welcome to lecture number 41 of digital electronics subject in the lectures from 35 to 40 we were dealing with the reduction of boolean expressions using kmap there we have dealt with only sum of product forms and product of sum forms without any extra expressions but in this lecture, what we are going to introduce is don't care combination. So, what is basically meant by a don't care combination? Don't care. Okay. So, as the uh, word meaning implies, it means uh, whatever value comes, please don't care. Okay. Whatever is the value, whatever is the value. No need to care, no need to take care of it. Take care of it. Okay. Now, if you need, if you need to have an example of this don't care combination, you need to have an example. In the case of XS3 code, okay. The combinations like 0, 0, 0, 0, combination 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, these are uh, these are invalid these are invalid okay so the way to include so the way to include these invalid combinations these invalid combinations to the boolean expression to the boolean expression is called don't care. Is called don't care. Now, while dealing with SOP form, the don't care values or don't care combinations are taken as one. Whereas, or the don't care values or don't care values which is coming in in the corresponding cells are taken as one. Whereas in POS form, the don't care values is taken as is taken as zero. That means the don't care values, the don't care values can be can be zero or one, depending on depending on the form of representation, depending on the form of representation. That is whether it is um, SOP or POS. Now, these don't care combinations are uh, these don't care combinations are generally designated by the this don't care combinations are de generally designated by the letter D or it can be phi or in some respects you can deal with X. Okay. Can be, uh, can be written by D, Phi or X. Okay, this is the general combination. So, um, let me, okay. So, with that brief introduction, let me move into, um, let me move into a simple problem. How to realize a, or how to reduce an expression which is having this don't care combination. So, question is given by. Question number one. Reduce, so reduce the expression, reduce the expression, f is equal to sigma m, 1, 5, 6, 12, 13, 14, 1, 5, 6, 12, 13, 14, plus don't care, d, 2, 4, Reduce and realize it using and realize it using realize it using suitable universal logic. Okay, that means you can use either NAND gates only or NOR gates only. Now see, 
in the expression which is given you are having don't care okay and again it is given in which format sum of product format or in min term format okay so first of all let me draw the um, root table uh, the k map so first i'm going to draw the k map okay since it is up to 14 you can know that uh, you can uh, draw a four variable k map And again, it is in SOP form. So, one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah. So this is A B C D. Zero 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 one 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 zero. Zero 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 one 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 zero. A bar B bar. A bar B, A B, A B bar, C bar, D bar, C bar, D, C, D, C, D bar, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Now let me take its values. Yeah, one uh, and this is a SOP form. So so you should write the values as one, one, five, six, tall, thirteen, and fourteen. And at uh, two and four, you, it, it is don't care. So at uh, two and four, at uh, two, then you can write D at uh, two and four. That is four. Yeah this don't care so you can write d5 or uh, you can use x so in terms some uh, terms, uh, terms which is using x but it is easy to use d uh, that, that means you will understand it is, whether it is a don't care so you can use d now i am going to plug the factors okay so here you can have a quad so you can have a quad that means here this d is considered as one so concern that quad, the equation is in 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 rows which is common B, in column which is common C bar. So you get B C bar. Again, you can consider one more uh, quad like this. You can construct quad in this format. These four terms. That forms a quad because it is differing only by one bit. Okay. Because uh, C bar D bar is there, yeah. Okay. Now in 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 these two rows, which is common, B is common. In these two columns, which is common, D bar is common. So you can write it as uh, B D bar. Now what is remaining? What is remaining is only this one. So try to make it into a pair. So if I am trying to make it into a pair, these two forms, a pair can make that pair, right? Okay. So what is that? We are trying to make that into a pair. What is that? Here it is common. A bar is common. Here with in this one you will get C bar D. So it is A bar, C bar, D. Therefore, the uh, um, uh, minimized SOP expression can be written as F is equal to B C bar or B D bar or a bar c bar d okay see in in don't care means uh, if uh, if it is required then only you can add it okay now see here you, you can take uh, this don't care this don't care is not not required to form the expression so even if only required you can take the value as one okay no need to there is no cut and write rule in such a way that all the don't care values should be kept, taken as one even if if it is required, then only you can take it in the quad or octet or pair or you can take it as a value. Okay. Now here this don't care. Here this value is actually not required in forming the expression. Which value? This one here. Yeah. This value is actually not required in forming the expression. So we have excluded it. That is all. Now 
the next part is uh, you, you, you need to realize it using a suitable universal logic. That is the question. So you can write what f is equal to f is equal to b c bar or b d bar or a bar c bar d a bar c bar d. So what is f bar? f bar is b c bar or b d bar or a bar c bar d the whole bar what is it that is b c bar bar dot b d bar bar dot a bar c bar d the whole bar ok now what is f bar bar f bar bar is f that is equal to this this is done with the help of de morgan's law So F bar bar, F component of component is F, that is B C bar bar dot B D bar bar dot A bar C bar D bar the whole bar. So this is basically what is NAND logic. Because the uh, because each time you can uh, realize it using NAND. So come in the first time, B C bar the whole bar. So you can, so you are having A bar is one input. A bar B is on input, A bar is there, uh, B is there, then C bar is on input, then D, and you can have D bar, no problem. Okay, you can have D and D bar. So, the first one is B, C bar, the whole bar. B, C bar, the whole bar gives, it gives, it gives a NAND gate. B, C bar, the whole bar. So, you get the first step. So you got the first term. Second term is what? B D bar the whole bar. Second term is B D bar the whole bar. So B is here, D bar is here. So B D bar the whole bar. That is the second term. What is the third, third term? Third term is um, A bar C bar D. So A bar is here. C bar. C bar is there, B is here. So if you are, if you are drawing the circle, here what we get? This A bar, C bar, D, the whole bar. Now you got all the three, right? Now please NAND or if you are if you are NANDing all these three, if you are NANDing all these three, what we get is. So this is a basic NAND logic circuit. Okay. So here you are having A, A bar, B, C bar, and D as inputs. A bar. Yeah, right. Okay. So here are having this is. Oh sorry, there is one mistake but I have drawn here. And D should be taken in this way. Yeah. D should be taken directly. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so that is um circuit using NAND logic only. So I think you have got the uh, got a flyer how to uh, how to take care of these uh, don't care combinations. So coming into the second question. Minimize minimize the following expressions. Using K map. The question is given by f is equal to f of uh, say w h y z is equal to sigma m four five seven four five seven twelve fourteen fifteen twelve fourteen fifteen plus don't care. Okay, you can write sigma don't care, no problem. Plus sigma don't care, 3, 8, and 10. 3, 8, and 10. Okay. 
Okay, so first of all, from the given expression, it is in SOP form. And since you have to 15, it is, uh, you, have, you need to deal with four variable K map. Okay, so first of all, draw in the K map. So this is y bar is at bar, y bar is at y is at y is at bar, w bar h bar, w bar h, w h, w h bar. So row 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15. So you have to take once where, where we are getting the value at 4, 5, 7, 12, 14, 15. Then don't care at 3, 8, and 10. 3 is don't care, 3 is don't care, 8. 3, 8 is don't care, and 10 is also don't care. Okay. Now, if we can, um, if we are able to pair or take the quad. So, first I am going to take the quad combinations. So, here I can take a quad. Right? These two forms a quad. So, what is the corresponding expression? So, in, in, in third row and fourth row, which is, which is common, W is common. In first column and last column, which is common, is a bar. So, it is W is a bar. Now what I can take, now I can take it as, um, yeah, I can take, these two, as uh, pairs, right, these two again pair it, and if I am pairing, what I am getting, If I am pairing, what you get is This way can pair. So if, we, if I am pairing it, the what I am getting is uh, W bar H and uh, which is common Y bar. W bar H Y bar. Yeah. W bar H Y bar. Okay. Now no need to take this five. I can I can take uh, these two, right? So now I can take I can take the pair and take this pair, right? Okay. I am taking that pair. What is the resulting expression? So here, which is common in the rows, H is common, and here it is Y set. So it is H Y set. So the simplified expression is F is equal to W is a bar, or W bar H Y bar, or H Y set. That is the most simplified form of the expression. Okay. So that was already minimized the following expression. So I have I have given the minimized form in SOP form using this um, K map technique. So coming into a next question, third question. Minimize. Minimize the following expression minimize the following expression
you will see care map okay so question is given by f is equal to f is equal to sigma m 1 3 7 11 15 1 3 7 11 15 plus uh, sigma don't care 0 2 5 so here this is given in SOP form and since the value is up to 15 it is a uh, we should deal with a 4 variable k map ok first of all let me draw the k map draw in the k map 1 2 3 1 2 and 3 ok so this is a b c d 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 this is a bar b bar a bar b a b a b bar c bar d bar c bar d c d c d bar ok so this is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 so let me take the values first so values are at 1 you will get 1 3 7 11 and 11 15 and don't get at a 0 at the 0 2 and 5 they are having don't care so if you are simplifying it so I can get a quad here this is the first quad ok so what is it uh, here which is common a bar is common in the rows and in the columns d is common so it is a bar d and the second quad I have only two quads directly so I can take the second quad like this so can take the second quad yeah. so this is the second quad ok I am taking the second quad what is the expression it is only CD therefore the most simplified expression what we are getting is f is equal to a bar d or CD that is the most simplified SOP form of expression ok so I think you have got the logic of minimizing the expression using KMAP and don't care. Okay. So in this lecture we have dealt with uh, reducing the expression of uh, uh, we have uh, we have introduced what is a don't care combination. Okay. That means uh, it, it can take the values one or zero. Now where it, uh, for example if you are taking the SS3 code, the invalid codes you are taking it as don't care combination. Okay. So the so don't care include those invalid combinations to the volume expression is called don't care. So the if it is in SOP form, you will take the values of uh, values of uh, don't care combinations are as one, and if it is POS form, you take it as zero. And I have given three examples using how to in SOP form how to deal with this don't care. So in the next lecture, we, we will deal with how to include don't care in POS forms that is using match terms. So here we have dealt with only min terms. So in the next lecture we will be de will be dealing with max terms. How to include the don't care terms. So thank you, and uh, and awaiting you for the forty second lecture. Thank you.